you know what worries me about nana is he's beginning to give me maguire settings wrote to me he's finished seven six to man city on penalties at wembley in the community shield how are you feeling and how how do you think the performance went overall um actually i think the performance was quite adequate um i thought they would i guess you see I admire my, my reservations. I look at City and the quality of the squad they put out today, and I think it was pretty a pretty decent performance against their structure. Um, they still have some first team players in there as well, so um, I think they did pretty well. Um, a lot of chances missed. I'm beginning to see a team that is creating more chances. I saw that a bit in the preseason, but against City team like that, I saw that I, I like I like that. I still regard this game as a preseason. Obviously, there's a trophy on it and um yeah it's just unfortunate that uh we lost it to uh missed chances and a lousy penalty at the end so yeah it is what it is let's talk about the manager he's beginning he's been given a reprieve um is it do or die for um ten Hag this season um if he doesn't deliver do you think he'll get the um he'll be on the chopping block i think he's definitely been one of the luckiest coaches at united in the longest time i think this this new regime has proven that because you hardly ever see any new regime takeover happen and uh yeah they're good to you know replace them but yeah um it's crazy like i think they they definitely were able to um to sort that out and um you know once they do obviously like get um you know a certain run of games i think any else will be able to look at and make another assessment on the coach and um determine whether obviously he's someone that they're going to be looking at long term because um, for me I feel the acquisition of Van Nistelrooy is, um, is actually a good uh, master stroke um, I can see him taking over United in a couple of years I actually think that's the plan <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah it looks it looks like he, he has definitely has an aura you can tell there's an aura there um, and in the attacking player as a coach I can kind of see some of the things he's brought in as well you know them ones so it's a good thing. Um, a long may continue, and um, yeah, we need more signings as well. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, was, I was gonna, I was gonna touch on that. You know, you got a couple of players coming in from Bayern Munich. It seems. Um, aside of those players coming in, do you think you need more? And in and in what positions? Uh, I think we need two more midfielders, and we need at least one more midfielder to leave apart from McTominay, because I regard him as gone. Yeah. Um, rumor has it that so, Casemiro might, yeah, might still be out as well, but. I think personally, we need two midfielders to really raise the technical floor of the team. I think that it's been down for too long. And even when you have technical players, it's either they're over their, you know, their um, peak. Mm. So, you know, they can't really turn. They get bullied of the boys. Lee. You need a combination of those things, the physicality, um, the ball progression, and um, that, just that still and brute force in midfield. And also, we need that in defence as well. So, unfortunately, Euro is out. But obviously, with the new acquisition of Dele, that covers us fine. Hopefully, he stays fit too and doesn't join the uh, the voodoo the voodoo curse that is currently at United with injuries. So, yeah. Uh, l last question. I'm going to talk about your goalkeeper. I, I, d I don't think he's good enough to play for Man United. But what are your thoughts on him? He said he's going to take more risks this season. Uh, we saw him in the penalty shootout. Couldn't get anywhere near any of the penalties, apart from the first one. Can you... Uh, rediscover the form of previous Man United teams with this goalkeeper in, in, in between the sticks? You know, what worries me about Nana is he's beginning to give me Maguire settings. You know them ones. Like, you know, that player that is like so confident that he feels he's a lot more confident than he actually is. Well, as good as he actually is. And I think he needs to be careful. Although the problem is he's already at United and a lot of these players at United sometimes he gets to them, so... It might be a bit too late for that, but overall, I, I think he's okay. Um, you know, it's a bit hard to take the Champions League performance that he put out last season out of my head, to be very honest, because it was an absolute calamity, bruv. You get me? But other than that, I think, you know, I'll still give him another season, um, see what he does, and then um, hopefully he performs better. Cheers, bro.